Um, some of the, a uh, couple of things I would give to it for advice for s people that have students with disabilities in the classrooms um, is to use direct and literal language. Uh, students that are on the spectrum really need direct and literal language. If you nail the use of direct and literal language, it will help everyone with a disability. It's, uh, it's closer to universal design. Uh, universal design would be the second piece. If you design a syllabus or a um, activity or anything that works for everyone without it necessarily being a specific accommodation, that's, use, that's really helpful to, to all. Uh, a simple example of, of that, a very simple example would be, um, sometimes people will put week one, week two, week three on a syllabus. That's really hard for a student with a disability to translate into a due date. If you simply put the due dates on the syllabus, that's easier for everyone. Um, that's universal design. It's easier for everyone in the classroom, not just the student with a disability.